The Nigerian Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Torid Lagbaja, has assured the management of the Nigerian Army Heritage and Future Center of his continuous support to the execution of their mandate to achieve the aims and objectives of the operation. He made this known at a one-day inaugural lecture organized by the center titled Transforming the Future Center from Dream to Reality in Abuja. Lieutenant General Lagbaja said, the mirage of challenges ranging from terrorism, banditry, kidnapping, and farmers' elder clash, among his others, has called for redefined solutions, noting that his command philosophy of transforming the Nigerian army into a world-class, highly motivated force shall not fail to adequately equip the center staff to optimally perform their task for a safer country. The establishment of the Nigerian Army Heritage and Future Center is geared towards positioning the operations of the Nigerian Army to meet the current trends of insecurity in the country. Part of this idea is to inform, train, and equip the operation officers with new strategies for combating security threats across the region. Owing to this auspicious inaugural lecture to generate quality and valuable ideas for the Nigerian Army. While speaking, the Chief of Army Staff said the event is apt as the outcome will assist the management team in attaining its core vision to serve as a research for the generation of ideas, policies, and strategies to defeat the current and future security threats. Today, criminal groups across the zones are fast keeping pace with our options, thereby making our efforts of not too significant effect. Therefore, establishments such as the Nigerian Army Heritage and Future Center must rise to the occasion by equally turning out options for the Nigerian Army at a pace the bad guys cannot keep up with. Therefore, I expect that today's lecture and the subsequent interactive session will generate new ideas and outcomes that we elucidate the nexus between the Nigerian Army Heritage and Future Center's vision and my command philosophy of transforming the Nigerian Army into a well-trained, equipped, and highly motivated force towards achieving our constitutional responsibilities within a joint environment. Finding such a nexus will help align the center with my philosophy of command and make the center a veritable tool for achieving my vision for the Nigerian Army. Earlier, the Director General of the Nigerian Army Heritage and Future Center, Major General Obina Ajunwa, said the Maiden Seminar is in line with their determination to fulfill the constitutional mandate to deal with the complex and uncertain security environment facing the country. The center is created as a research hub to address Nigerian specific thematic challenges through studies, analysis, policy formulations that target optimal operational and administrative outcomes for the Nigerian Army. The establishment order outlined some rules and responsibilities to the center, some of which require further clarifications and retuning, hence the need for today's seminar. We are determined to make the center truly a hub for research on past military exploits, while casting for future of the Nigerian Army in a complex and uncertain security environment. The Army Chief therefore pledged its unflagging support to the nation's democracy, even as he commended President Tinobu's desire to improve the Army operations with modern-day technology. Vincent Okushi, reporting for Quality Television. Audio